UN Special Envoy for Libya issued a warning to the country's fielding political actors, stating that without the urgent formation of a unified government and progress towards election, the oil-rich North African nation could slide into disintegration. Abdullahi Bateli urged all political leaders to set aside their self-interests, come together to negotiate and reach a compromise to restore the dignity of their motherland. The government of national unity is yet to provide the budget for this very important process. In the first week of February, 11 high national electoral commission fills offices in area under the administration of the HOR appointed government were instructed to suspend their activity and close. During this Thursday briefing to the Security Council on Libya, Batili stressed the importance of convincing military and security parties to participate in the political process for successful elections. The President of the High Council of State, Mr. Mohamed Takala, maintains his rejection of the electoral laws as published by the HOR, demanding to revert to the draft agreed upon by the 6 plus 6 Joint Committee in Bosnica. Emphasizing the need for a political settlement with a specific timetable, the UN envoy to Libya reiterated his opposition to any initiative that could fuel the conflict and endanger the lives of Libyans. I reiterate that progress on holding credible national elections is not possible without a political settlement amongst Libyan main institutional stakeholders. Abdullahi Batili's impassionate plea to Libya's political actors highlights the imminent danger of prolonging the crisis, urging a unified government and a commitment to elections. The UN Special Envoy stressed the necessity for dialogue, compromise, and a specific timetable for political settlement. The stark warning serves as a call to action, emphasizing the critical role of international support in averting further destabilization in Libya.